The mountain streams that we work in are small headwater streams. You can roll up your pant legs and walk across. They're not real big, but there's a lot going on beneath the surface. There's a lot going on with the life and the chemistry. The Shendell Watershed Study started in 1979 as a collaborative project between the University of Virginia and the National Park Service, and then expanded to streams beyond the park. 35 years ago, we were just beginning to understand the effects that pollutants were having on the atmosphere. By measuring weekly water chemistry and understanding the hydrology of these systems, we're getting information from the entire watershed. Sulfuric acid is one of the components of acid rain that changes the pH of the stream system. And that change in pH is crucial to facilitating other chemical reactions, which impact the habitat quality for the fish and everything that lives in the stream. We also bring in students to pose new questions, collect new data, and also we're trying to understand new pollutants that we hadn't thought about back 35 years ago. Mercury is a hazardous material. It hurts human life, it hurts other forms of life. We're going back hundreds of years, and we're seeing that as soon as the Industrial Revolution came, we see this huge increase. We've made a lot of progress, and we've impacted legislation, and we've cleaned up the atmosphere for targeted pollutants but we are not back to the natural health of these systems. You know, 35 years ago, we didn't know what was going on in this environment. We have a much better understanding of what the impacts are of acid deposition and how different streams recover differently and why that is. But it also gives us the understanding to move forward, to be prepared to answer the next emerging questions 